ट्रांजिस्टर एज एम्पलीफायर एम्पलीफायर इज यूज फॉर वोल्टेज एम्पलीफिकेशन करेंट एम्पलीफिकेशन और पावर एम्पलीफिकेशन हियर वी आर यूजिंग एन पी एन ट्रांजिस्टर फॉर वोल्टेज एम्पलीफिकेशन इट इज एन पी एन बिकॉज द एरो इज टू दिस साइड दैट इज एमीटर इज एन बेस इज पी एंड दिस इज कलेक्टर विच इज ऑल्सो एन दिस ट्रांजिस्टर इज बायस्ड इन एक्टिव मोड इन विच the base emitter is forward biased and base collector is reverse biased with base being poor conductor because it is thin region and also consist mainly of depletion region so the collector and emitter current are large base current remains small the emitter current is sum of base current and collector current the emitter and collector current are of order of milli ampere now the input voltage which is to be amplified is fed here in the base section and the output is taken across the collector the emitter is kept common hence it is called common emitter mode also the input is in base the output is in collector and emitter act common that is it is either grounded or acts as reference the output voltage will be the collector voltage which we can see here as vcc minus icrc because when the current flows in this direction the voltage will decrease so the output will be vcc minus icrc the rc is the output resistance which is kept high and in the active mode in which the circuit is being used the now the collector current is also high now when the input is in positive cycle it adds to the forward biasing of base emitter and therefore the collector current will increase because as the forward biasing increases more number of free electrons the emitter will send and the reverse biasing of the collector will pull majority of those free electrons giving rise to high collector current so we can see that as the collector current increases the output voltage will decrease it will decrease by large amount due to large value of the collector current and large value of the collector resistance we are drawing only the variable part of the voltage so when the input section is in forward cycle the output of the collector will be in negative cycle that is out of phase with the input because when the base current increases or the input voltage increases the collector current also increases but this minus sign makes the voltage more negative again when the input section goes into negative cycle then the forward biasing decreases and as a result the collector current decreases by large amount and the fluctuation now goes into the positive part as a result of high collector current and high resistance amplitude of the output becomes very large and the amplification is achieved the ratio collector current to base current is known as beta called current gain in common emitter mode and the voltage gain obtained will be equal to output voltage by input voltage which will be equal to collector current into collector resistance divided by the input current into input resistance that is beta into rc by rb which will be called as resistance gain this is also called resistance gain so the voltage gain is further amplified because of large current gain and high resistance gain we are using only the alternating part that is the alternating voltage which is amplified here and hence voltage amplification is achieved here thank you